Measles outbreak in Texas rises to 24 cases and counting with neighboring states expecting spillover. Measles is one of the most contagious diseases in the world. It can spread like wildfire through a population, especially in those unvaccinated or immunocompromised. It is so contagious that it is estimated nine out of 10 people with close contact to a measles patient who are unvaccinated will contract the disease. Measles is a single-stranded enveloped RNA virus that is part of the Paramyxoviridae family. Its only natural host is humans. Symptoms typically start with what is called the three C's, which are cough, coryza, and conjunctivitis. This is often accompanied by a high fever, sometimes climbing to 105 degrees Fahrenheit. Afterward, patients often develop a maculopapular rash that spreads from the head to the trunk to the legs. People can also develop coptic spots, which are white or bluish lesions that develop on the inside of the mouth and are classical for measles infection. People are most contagious from four days before the rash develops to four days after the rash develops. It is transmitted through respiratory droplets when infected people breathe heavily, cough or sneeze and can remain in the air for up to two hours after the infected individual leaves. Once infected, people can develop ear infections, severe pneumonia or inflammation of the brain called encephalitis. It can rarely cause a chronic debilitating disease called subacute sclerosing panencephalitis that can be incurable. There is no highly effective treatment. Young children are often treated with vitamin A. Otherwise, it is only supportive care. The measles vaccine is recommended to prevent measles infection and is considered highly effective. For more on medical education and public health news, check out our YouTube channel, Whiteboard Medicine.